Flu experts say it's not too late to get vaccinated, despite a spike in cases. Infections in Queensland are up more than 500% on last year, but the worst is yet to come. You know when flu season's about to reach its peak, the echo's just around the corner. Certainly seeing a lot more cases. And this year, alarm bells are ringing. So far, there have been 3,817 reported cases in Queensland. Last year to this point, there'd been only 574. A third of them this time, a swine flu. It's still circulating out there in the community and people are catching it. Although it's not quite as potent. Health authorities say the wet weather is partly to blame. People tend to be indoors more um, with other people, so it's easier for the flu to spread. The stress hasn't helped either. Those effects are going to take their toll on their immune system. And this year there are three main flus out there, two strains of influenza A, H1N1 or swine flu, and H3N2, and one of influenza B called the Brisbane strain. The Brisbane flu was named because it was discovered here a couple of years ago. Since then it's been around the world and now it's back this winter. It'll go around the world seasonally and come back and hit the place that it started from a lot harder in the second or third year. Experts say hygiene is important and there's still time to get a jab. Anyone who's in one of the risk categories should definitely go and